Chief Minister Conrad Sangma on Wednesday, accompanied by Rongara Siju Emily Rakam Sangma, and officials visited flood-hit locations in South Karo Hills, including Siju, to assess the damage caused due to multiple landslides and flooding along National Highway 62 that connects Siju, Karukol, and Bagmara from East Karo Hills and Assam and has remained completely cut off since last week. A lot of devastation everywhere. And the main reason this is happening is because both sides are cut off. And from neither side uh, are big machines being able to come to clear these roads. And that's why this entire place is just simply cut off. And therefore, even to clear these, all these roads, this is the main road. The whole thing has collapsed. And in order for the machines to reach here, we have to get the connectivity from at least one side. So we're hopeful in the next 24 to 48 hours, we should be able to get that connectivity. And hopefully then we'll be able to start clearing these roads. Travelling via a boat for about two hours to Siju and three-hour trek to Rongdong, Chief Minister Konrad Sangma expressed his shock to witness the unimaginable damages caused due to extremely heavy rainfall in the past week. The Chief Minister informed that the extent of the damage caused is devastating and restoration work is taking time considering the massive damages to the roads. The Chief Minister assured that the government has been making every effort to ensure that all possible help is extended and said that restoring electricity in South Karo Hills has been taken up on priority and restoration works are on in full swing. The extent of damage is, is great, really high. Uh, many roads have been uh, washed out, many areas, the landslides are huge. And I think this is one of the most uh, uh, devastating kind of flood situations that we may have faced in recent past. And uh, it will take some time to restore. Uh, the district has been out of uh, power for almost uh, five days now. We are hopeful that in a uh, few uh, days, maybe a day or so, we should be able to restore the power back here. And we're hopeful that even the road connectivity, at least the uh, clearance of the roads should be done at the earliest. During his interaction with elderly residents of Siju, the chief minister was informed that they have never seen such heavy rains and landslides in the past 50 years. The residents also informed that the water level of the Simsang River near Siju Cave has risen by 30 feet and the Raybak Hanging Bridge was seen to be completely damaged despite it being 50 feet above normal water level. We are on the Simsang and we took this bridge over Simsang going to Rewak uh, area and uh, this has been uh, uh, done by the border area and uh, a very important lifeline for the people out here. And you can see that the water level goes up to the level of the bridge and it crossed over, that's how high the water went. And this has been badly damaged and uh, we will do whatever it takes and necessary to ensure that this bridge is uh, repaired at the earliest as this is a major lifeline uh, for the people out here.